I am the director for the department in charge of uh, investment policy in Costa Rica at the Ministry of Foreign Trade. Cooperation is a, a definite uh, important factor to getting those consensus that you need to move forward agendas, especially when they are as ambitious as the ones that we are looking for. Uh, the Dominican Republic, Costa Rica, and Panama decided to conform the ADD, the, the ad, uh, in a sense because we, we were uh, all uh, identifying common opportunities uh, and uh, we decided also to put aside any challenges that we had even between us because we have something to work on that joins us. And, and so that's the philosophy behind uh, joining up forces, but also the philosophy behind partnering to work with yet the most important partner that we have in common, which is the United States, in looking for ways to really uh, generate those opportunities for our people uh, and, and jobs in all of the four countries uh, as a result of that. Costa Rica shares some of the migrants that come uh, to the U.S. from the south. They come to, from the north to Costa Rica. But not only that, we also receive some of those that enter through Panama and that come from even uh, afar. So really, a, you know, migration is, is, is a shared a problem, but it's also something that I think goes to the root of, of the more solidarity, human solidarity kind of, of aspects. And, and you need to, to not lose a sight of that, that human side. We invest very uh, deeply in Costa Rica, in health, in education, and uh, this is broadly available to anybody that inhabits in the country, uh, whether uh, it's a Costa Rican born or not. Uh, this is a small contribution from a small country, but that we think is probably a right way of looking at uh, solving immigration issues in, in, in a longer term kind of, kind of, of aspect. I don't think in any way that Costa Rica is at a limit as regards the opportunities that we can generate. In fact, I think that one of the things that has helped us navigate the different external shocks that come and that as a small country that is so open, but also so interconnected to the global economy itself, you know, we would feel them very, very deeply if we did not approach them in a very creative and innovative manner. And with a keyword that I really like to stress when I talk about the long-standing trade and investment policy that the country has, which is our bet on diversification. Things are changing in the world, just in general, consumption patterns, but also the way in which companies are looking to address the needs of the consumer. And uh, Costa Rica, with uh, its green values, with its also solidarity and inclusion um, way of thinking, uh, I think fits very well in those types of, of uh, strategies. And we are uh, talking to the companies, not only conveying that this is the case, but also listening to their needs and uh, working together in ways to find uh, how we can be more competitive and help them continue to add value in the country.